I'm just being annoying with the sound effects. <laughs> But I did make this beautiful cup. Actually, no, I didn't make it. I lied. I purchased this beautiful cup in Fayoum where the people there in that area, they make tons of pottery. And this really stood out to me and I picked this up. So if you didn't watch this video of me and Fayoum struggling to make pottery, you're welcome. Just click on it, watch it after this video. You'll enjoy it, trust me. All right, so in today's video, I am super, super excited because, oh wait, I forgot to do my intro. What's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name's Jody, and in this video, I'm gonna be taking you guys to this beauty salon called Lines, where I'm gonna be getting my eyebrows powdered, microbladed, and I'm really excited for it because I've gotten my brows microbladed before about four or five years ago and I think it's time to do them because they're like fading a little bit and the first time I did them I got them done in Dubai at Brows UAE and they did a really really good job. So I'm really excited but nervous but I know that the person doing my brows today is an expert and they know what they're doing and they did my friend's eyebrows before and I was so impressed so I'm really excited for that transformation I'm also going to be getting like other beauty treatments as well uh, throughout this month because we're trying to enter 2022 as cute as possible and yeah so I want to share with you guys what the beauty world is like here in Egypt. Nobody loves beauty more than I feel like the Egypt the Egyptian people. Like they like everyone is just like well maintained, groomed, like just like beautiful and like perfect. So I'm excited. <laughs> I am dressed and ready to head out. So comment down below if you're like me but whenever you are working with someone in very close proximity whether it's someone like doing your brows or your nails or just some type of like beauty treatment where someone's going to be like really close to you I like to make sure two things my breath is on point okay and second that I smell really good since we were talking about beauty treatments and it is the holiday season I thought I would share like two scents that I'm really into right now. Um, I really like this K Ali Vanilla 28. I just literally spray it all over me and I've gotten like compliments on it. So I feel like it's, I don't know if you're into like vanilla scents, this would be it. Second, this one I absolutely love and I didn't think it was going to be for me when I bought it in the summer. Uh, at Sephora is Indian Jasmine by Nest. I get a lot of compliments on this one. And so I just take the oil, just do like a quick little demo. And I put it behind my ear. And I also put it on my wrist. I already put some on. I'm just showing you guys like the places I put it. And I also put it like here as well. And, oh, and my decolletage, I put it there as well. I'll probably put a little bit more. And honestly, I just smell so bomb. And so I just hope that whoever is in close proximity to your girl really appreciates <laughs> the effort that I put because I can't imagine. Actually, it's happened to me with someone doing my lashes and their breath was just... <laughs> to lay there for two hours under some funky breath I just I try to smell as good as possible when being around people that are really close to me so yeah <laughs> All right, you guys, so I had to come a little bit earlier than expected because I needed to get some numbing cream. So you have to numb your brows for about 30 minutes before you start your microblading process.
Mm. All right, you guys, so this is the first part. It's just the bleeding. And then next you're gonna do the powder. Yes. Yeah. Ooh, so okay, so these are the brows. They're gonna fade and shrink. <laughs> Alright you guys, so I'm in the elevator and I'm about to head out to lines. You can see my eyebrows. They're so dark. I can't wait till they start fading. But I'm about to get my nails done. Comment down below if the sound of getting your nails done drive you absolutely insane. I don't know why I do this to myself, but I love my nails. So I'm going to show you guys what I was going for, but the nail tech, she had other plans. What do you guys think? And the final results, what do you guys think? I know it's super simplistic, but that's just how I roll. All right, you guys, so now I'm probably gonna go to the grocery store to get some food. My nails, it's like hard to see, but there is some sparkle there, okay, I promise. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go book an Uber and I'll take you guys to the grocery store. So I'm getting what I normally always get. So they have a few Christmas tree kits for cookie decorating out, which is really cool. And a gingerbread house. I always grab the original granola, my fave. So this is the little bakery section. You can get your croissants, fresh bread, so after successfully leaving the bakery area without getting anything, I felt I deserved to get a Cinnabon. So now we are on our way to grab a Cinnabon. Egypt during the holiday season is really beautiful. There's tons of Christmas trees and lights all over the streets and restaurants and it's just a really nice time of year. One more last look at the nails. They're growing on me. Just got my Cinnabon. Okay, I'm headed home now to eat it. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching and see you in the next one.